Yo, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy Dead Games back with another video. Today I'm gonna talk about why Kevin Gates is the greatest artist ever. Well, like to me, I know music is subjective. Everybody has their own personal favorites, man. But to me, Kevin Gates is the greatest artist ever. And uh, I'm gonna tell you how God put me in vibration, like to listen to Kevin Gates, or God put me in vibration to discover Kevin Gates. And God strike me dead if I'm lying about anything I'm saying. Uh, like about, uh, it was like nine or 10 years ago. I remember I was playing basketball in the summer out here in Newark. I'm out here in New Jersey, man. I was playing basketball by the crib. I'm walking back home. And I remember laying down in bed, like, and I was looking at the scene. I was tired as hell. I'm talking about like tired though. Not like no normal, no normal type of tired. And like looking back on it, like on hindsight, it was because I used to be a fapper, man. <laughs> I used to jerk off all the time, man. Yeah, yeah, I ain't know. Like back then, I didn't know like the magic of sperm retention. Like I ain't know the magic of sperm, man. Like the sperm is a man life force. Has all our vitamins and nutrients, man. I ain't know that back then. But anyways, I remember, I remember I was in bed looking at the scene. I was like, man, I'm tired, man. And I remember I said, uh, this, was, this was exactly what I said. I was like, why am I so tired? Once I said that, bro, once I said that shit, I said, why am I so tired? Because I'm going to think I'm crazy when I say this, man. Because I'm going to think I'm crazy. It's like I seen a, like I seen a spirit. I seen a spirit in the ceiling, bro. Like, a, like an energy, like something happened. I can't even explain it, bro. It's something, it's something spiritual. open man <laughs> yeah it was something spiritual bro like it wasn't physical it's something it's hard to explain like it's like a subconscious activity man well once that happened i knew i knew what was gonna happen next like it was meant to happen like it was meant to it was meant to happen from a, like a higher power like like i knew that moment right there like like it was controlled by our power controlled by God, man. And, uh, I remember, right? It's like, it's like asking you should receive. It's like I asked, like, why am I so tired? Like, and then boom, like, anyways, what happened next? Like, for some reason, something made me, like, go on my phone. I was on YouTube. The first person I see, I see Kevin Gates. Like, I never knew about Kevin Gates. I see Kevin Gates. And, I, and once I saw him, I was like, oh, this, this dude right here is the He's the goat. I just, I just know, cause you know when you just know, it's like your intuition. You just know. So I clicked on it, and it was for the video of I D G A F. Like I don't give a fuck. So I heard, I heard the song, and I was like, damn. I was like, this, I was like, this dude go hard, man. <laughs> cause I knew this nigga was the goat, bro. <laughs> Yo, it's like I heard that song, and I was like, man. I started listening to, I think Luca Brasi, like story. The first one was out. So, you know, like Neon Lights, Arm of, Arms of a Stranger. I started listening to the whole album. I was like, damn, this dude. Then I heard, I think it was Satellites. Before that, he had, uh, I think, uh, I heard By Any Means, Pick It a Litter. I, I listened to everything, man. And then uh, I started listening to his interviews. I was like, oh, this dude, this dude talking the truth, man. He talking the truth. So I just knew he was the GOAT. I just knew he was the greatest right there, bro. Like, Anyways, boom. That that week it was uh, the Portuguese parade out here, like the Brazilian parade out here on Ferry Street in Newark. It was like for three days. So me and my boy, we go to Ferry Street, and uh, I was like, "Yo, bro, you gotta listen to Kevin Gates." He was like, "Kevin Gates." I was like, "Yo, bro, you gotta listen to Kevin. He, he's a great. He's gonna be the greatest artist, bro. I'm telling you. Now, he can vouch for me, man." And uh, boom. So whatever. We hit the parade. It was for three days. So the next day, we go to the parade again. Yeah, we go to the parade again. I was there. I remember at night, shit, we was drinking in the car. I don't drink them. No, I, I drink like a few times a year. We was drinking in the car, and uh, <laughs> he started blasting on uh, neon lights. And then he was like, yeah, bro. He was like, yeah, you're right. He, he go hard. 
He said, yeah. He said, they, he started telling me, like, what he like about him. As I told you, bro, cause I, know, I know the great ones when I see them, man. Like, I, I just knew, bro. I just knew, dog. So, anyway, uh, yeah, like, now why, why I think Kevin Gates is the greatest artist ever. Like, if you listen to his, uh, to his interviews, like, you could tell, uh, everything he's talking about, everything he talk about, he did it. Like you can tell he sound the truth, huh? You know, like, how, how, how other rappers, they, uh, they say stuff like they never live. Like, you can just tell, man, like, like you can tell by the energy. You can tell, like, like, Gates' energy, everything he talk about, he did it, man. Like, uh, you could just tell by people's energy, man. You could tell by somebody texting your phone. You could tell just you could tell by the energy if it's negative or positive, man. People writing in a book, you could tell, man. So, anyways, uh, yeah, you could tell everything talk about is the truth, man. Like other rappers don't talk, don't tell the truth, man. Another reason, bro, his music is fire, man. Come on, bro. This dude music fire, dog. Like all his music, every song he put out. It's fire, dog. Yeah, you could tell that. Uh, you could tell like he put effort into his music. You know what I'm saying, man? Like, you could tell he put. Uh, he gave it his all in every song, man. Like, you could tell, bro. Like he put love. He put love in his music, man. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. He put love in his music. Like you know how other rappers they only got like one good song, and the rest of the album is like. Like trash, not trash. I'm trying to be negative, but like you can tell they ain't put no effort, man. They just threw it out there. Like you can tell, like his, like his music, Kevin Gates' music. Like uh, he works on it, bro. Like he works on it hard, bro. Like he focused, man. All his music, all his music is fire, bro. Like bro, he's the only rapper though, that I get excited. Like when an album is about to come out. I don't even listen to all the rap. I just listen to Kevin Gates. Because I, I know he's the truth, man. So, uh... Like, uh... Another reason he's the GOAT, man. Bro. I just knew, bro. So, he's half Puerto Rican, too, man. So, I know, like, Puerto Ricans... Shit, we, we love hard, man. I'm Puerto Rican. We love hard, bro. Because we could love somebody to the death, man. Like, we'll die for somebody, bro. Because we'll love a bitch so much, we'll give it a... <laughs> we'll give a chick a three-piece, man. Some Mike Tyson blows, bro. <laughs> That's crazy. Nah, I'm just... I'm just fucking wrong, bro. Nah, but for real, though, man. <laughs> yeah, Kevin Gates, man. Like, if nobody... I don't know who's gonna watch this video, but, like, if nobody ever heard of Kevin Gates... Like, guy or woman, go listen to Kevin Gates, man. I feel like it's going to sound crazy, though. I feel like I like I was meant to listen to him. Like I got, like, a spiritual connection, man. That's why, I, that's why I say, like, God put me in vibration, like, to listen to him. Like, to discover Gates. Yeah, man. Like if you listen to his interviews too, bro, he be dropping wisdom, man. He be dropping knowledge, bro. I, I peep game. Like you can just tell by like, you can just tell by by him look by looking at him and talking. He's a good leader, man. Yeah, I peep game, bro. I can tell he's a good leader, man. Like you can tell like people trust him. I know, bro. I peep game. I peep energy, man. I got spiritual discernment now, bro. Like. Uh, SR, bro, senior retention, dog. I feel like a damn psychic, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, uh. So I just, I just, I just be thinking, like, how, like, I don't even listen to the radio, but, like, why they don't play Gates on the radio, bro? Like, like why people don't, I don't know people in the music industry don't know about him or what, man. This, like, he's the greatest artist ever, dog. 
Now, people got to know him in the industry. Like, he worked with a lot of artists, but I'm talking about, like, why you don't get played on the radio? You get what I'm saying, bro? Like, mainstream. I don't know, bro. Maybe, maybe you don't want to go mainstream. Maybe you got to sell your soul to go mainstream. But you can tell Gates will never do that, bro. You can tell, like, he's a man of morals and principles, bro. Yeah, it's... I just what I'm trying to say is uh like Gates like God first and Gates put me like he helped me he helped me a lot like on like some dark times man so uh, I love him for that bro like I love him I don't, I don't ever got like I don't gotta meet somebody to tell him I love him man but I love Kevin Gates man but I don't gotta meet him physically but Mentally, spiritually, I already met him. I know that shit gonna sound crazy, but like everything, like I visualize, like everything comes from the mind first. Yeah, like spiritually, like, I already met him, man. Cause we all connected, like, like all mind is one mind. We all connected, like, we all connected in the mind. Like subconsciously, we all connected, bro. We all got the same. We all got the same energy of God. And now we connect like like through thinking. It's like a transmitter and a receiver. We all connected like th through thinking, like to our brain. But yeah, I feel like I feel like I'm gonna meet him someday, like physically. God let it happen. If it's meant to be, it's gonna happen. Yeah. <laughs> if not, I'll meet you in the next round, man. Huh? Yeah, man. Cause that's why Kevin Gates a goat, man. Bro, he makes the greatest music. He has a, the best music ever, dog. And nobody make music like him. Yo, it's crazy, like. He from Louisiana, from down south. So I'm out here from, I'm over here in the north, but he sound like, like his lyrics. He sound like he from the, uh, he from the north, man. Like his lyrics, like the way he rap. Yeah. Uh, Cause you know, over here in the north, like in New York, New York, all, all the greatest artists come from New York. Cause the energy different over here, but we got to deal with the elements. We got to deal with the elements. Everything go fast, bro. Everything like a million miles an hour out here. And another reason, like the north, like the earth, like half, like half of the earth, like the north pole is a positive pole. And he down south. The south pole is a negative pole. Like those who get it, gonna understand. Like the earth is a magnet. And over here down in the north is the positive side of the magnet. That's where all the great ones come from New York. But it's all, we all got free will though, you know? He's from the south, but he's the greatest artist ever, bro. He's the greatest artist ever. I know, I know the great ones, bro. I, I, when I saw I knew, I just knew, dog. It's like, it was meant to be. Like, I just knew he was the greatest artist ever once I saw him. Yeah, man. Yeah, I'm about to I'm about to sign out, man. I'm about to I'm about to log off. Yeah, like, comment, and subscribe. It'll help your boy get in the algorithm, huh? And uh I just wanted to say shit, man. It's all God, man. That's all I can say. It's all God. I know God in control, man. Cause we control the thought, but he controls controls the outcome. So I should I could have been dead by now already, bro, but I'm still alive. I'm alive for some reason. I remember I used to say, man, I'll never get on no whack ass YouTube, man. That's like some pussy shit, bro. I don't even like talking a lot, bro. And, uh, but I realized that uh if I could help one person, I did God's work. If I could just help one person, huh? I'm trying to get to heaven, man. I know through YouTube you can like 
contact people through throughout the whole world, huh? Somebody from Africa could, could hear this shit, huh? So yeah. Shout out to my boy Jay. He told me to, to get on YouTube. And I, I would have never been on YouTube. But God got me here for a reason. Like it was meant to be, huh? But yeah, but I'm about to sign out, man. Just remember all God.